This weekend, 86 venues across Minneapolis are going to open their doors to the public. You'll be able to explore places that the public usually can't go. And one of those spots is the Federal Reserve Bank of Minneapolis. You've probably seen that big building where 1,100 people work on Hennepin Avenue and First Street. So what does the Fed do? Good question. Heather Brown talked with the CEO and president of the bank in Minneapolis. A lot of people hear Federal Reserve, they think interest rates. Sure. It's today's rate hike raise interest rates yet again. So what do you do here? Well, interest rates are part of what we do. On one of its eight floors are the economists, researchers. Is inflation cooled in March? Who collect data on Minnesota, Montana, the Dakotas, and parts of Michigan and Wisconsin. But we do a lot more than that. Underneath us, there's a big vault. There is a big vault. With a lot of money. And a lot of police. <laughs> uh, and we have a lot of security in this building to uh -huh. make sure that that money is protected because it's the American people's money. Uh -huh. And there's no cameras allowed in there, which is why we're standing up here. Correct. <laughs> so they have a pallet of cash. Is this real money? Money? It's real money. Displayed in the front lobby. $4.6 million? $4.6 million. <laughs> this is an example of what our robots move around. If you've ever gotten money from a bank or ATM in Minnesota, that cash likely came from their vault. So you're a bank for the banks? Correct. We get requests in from banks in the district who say we need more 20s. They will send a truck. We will supply them with 20s. How often are these trucks? coming in and out of here. All day, every day. There are billions of dollars in their basement. Is the vault giant down it's a, there? It's a large, it's a very large <laughs> vault. The Fed also needs to make sure every dollar that comes in. Each note, like a 20 has the green ribbon here. Isn't counterfeit. If you look in and examine it very closely, you can see there where it says $5 written there. Oh, yep, sure can. So you said the seventh floor is where the data crunchers are. What Correct. are on all the other floors? Well, we do a lot of other things, too. <laughs> like, more important these days. The Federal Reserve is taking some of the blame for last month's collapse of Silicon Valley Bank. The Fed supervises banks. We want to make sure that they are making good investments with your money so that those banks are safe and so that your savings are protected. And finally in the lobby is a chair. We made it for the state fair. Full of $1.7 million of shredded cash. Why are we shredding money? Well, so these are the old bills and notes wear out. We shred the old money and then we replace it with a new one. So if somebody comes and visits us, they can get a little sample of shredded money here. <laughs> Heather Brown would probably be pretty hard to put all this back it would together. Be very hard to put it all back together. <laughs> WCCO News. If you want to visit yourself, the Fed's doors open this Saturday and Sunday from 10 until 5. And they also offer free tours if you can't make it this weekend.